Flight of the Swans project was born out of a need to try and save the Buick Swan. We've lost about 40% in the last 20 years. This crazy idea was born that just by a person flying a paramotor, A, you could collect data in remote places, but you'd also attract the attention of a lot of people generally. We use Met Office data quite often just for planning local flights around the UK. So when it became obvious that the weather was going to have such a major role to play, the Met Office was an obvious choice for us to go to for expert help. Because this expedition is going to quite extreme places, we're going to have to really be quite confident in our own ability to look at the forecast, but then also interpret the immediate weather behind us. It's really important, not just for me, but for the whole ground crew to have a good understanding of the potential risks and weather windows you might have. With any long flights and expeditions, what you really need is access to really reliable weather information uh, and to be able to customise that to your particular flight plan. And that's what this software is going to be able to do for us. The Met Office is designated under contract to the Civil Aviation Authority to help protect light aircraft, ballooning, gliders, people who enjoy flying for fun. Uh, in addition, of course, we support the commercial airlines and things like this. There are warnings that we issue of strong winds and fog. And also we recognise that this needs to be accessed in lots of ways. So not only have we got a website that you can look on a computer, but we have mobile phone access, and tablet access. It's really important that pre-flight and from pretty much anywhere, um, I can access really up-to-date weather information. And that's everything from ground speed, uh, winds at height, uh, rain forecasts and everything. The Met Office have always been in the background. I've never really relied on them directly uh, as a source of information. I didn't know that that information was directly available. It's easy to access and uh, we have a, a very valuable source of information that's direct. And, and not via other third parties, which is, I think, very important.